How is everybody doing? I hope you guys are all doing very well. It's the Popsita. I'm coming at you guys with another, the next part of uh, my walkthrough of EA's Star Wars Squadrons, a game where you play as the ships, the pilots of the ships, and you have air to air combat. So, we did both prologues, and we did uh, Mission 1, so we did Lord Vader's Command, and called a Rebellion, and then formed the Vanguard in the first part. So now, we're going to be doing the Skies of Yavin. So, let's kick it off. Let's see if I can remember how to play. Oh, okay. Do it again. So you want? You just want to let me inspect you? Uh, what's this over here? Briefing. What's Cunning Heal? The Empire won't push into our territory again anytime soon. Thanks to our new pilot. Yeah, and thanks to the rest of us. This isn't a race, all right? We're a team. You're right, honey. But still, nice flying out there. See, somebody's a little, uh... Speaking of fancy flying, Sunday. I was thinking about the Dragon Void run from a few what? years back. You see that one, Keo? Oh, sure. I caught the whole thing on the hollow net. Yeah, me too. I've watched the entire thing, but for the life of me, I can't recall who won. I think it was one of the Ash Twins? No, wait. Delon Vuk. Yeah, that's it. Boy, he was something else back then. In fact, the only pilot I've seen that comes close since is Keo here. Oh, come on. Delon Vuk's got nine championships under his belt. I've only got five. Not really. Well, Halfway. pun as this is, Commander Javes has someone special waiting for us in the briefing room. Let's get in there and find out what's next. <gasps> it better truly be somebody special. I'm gonna be Commander's waiting. angry. Let's see what the briefing has to say. So where is it now? I helped Talus Group chase it away from a medical convoy towards Yavin. It's pinned in the upper atmosphere with no hyperdrive, but too many fighters for Talus Group to handle alone. This might work out for both of us. Come, meet our visitor. Wedge Antilles, Rogue Squadron. I hear you're true? the reason I was able to finally get a calm through. He's great. I have a Star Destroyer problem that Vanguard might be able to help me solve. We need a Star Destroyer for Project Starhawk. Intact. Now we prove what Vanguard's made of. Wedge, if you would. Mighty. Oh, thought that was Bosk. Settle, folks! <laughs> As you may have overheard, Talos Group has cornered the Imperial Star Destroyer Victorum above the planet Yavin. They're in tough, but it's presented a great opportunity for us to jump in and not only disable that Star Destroyer, but to seize control. So first, we need to give ourselves some cover by knocking out the turrets. Naturally, if we can also take out the targeting system, that'll buy us even more time. Next, we need to prepare the Star Destroyer for boarding. We'll need to find a potential breach point in the Victorum's hull, preferably near the bridge. Once you find a good spot, bombard it until the hull is breached. Bombardment! However, Bombardment! We can expect that the Victorum still has plenty of TIE fighters. They will try to stop us. Once the skies are clear, we can bring in the boarding team. While our troops capture the bridge, Vanguard will defend the exterior from reinforcements. Once the boarding team has seized the bridge and is in control of the Star Destroyer, we will rendezvous with the Temperance. Okay, I think I accidentally made stealing a Star Destroyer sound simple. <laughs> Let's hope it is. As I said, by God, we're gonna have a Star Destroyer on the Rebel side. Uh, Lindo, Nardo, Reapin, Wedge. Yeah, let's see. Hanger. All right, let's talk to Wedgie. Sorry for the speedy introduction, but Talus Group was counting on me to get reinforcements fast. Your commander says you have talent. Enough to steal a Star Destroyer and get away with it. Normally, I'd have Rogue Squadron for this, but General Sindula gave me a temporary assignment to Project Starhawk. Meanwhile, Rogue is handling, well, that's classified too. Ooh. General Sindula keeps us busy. 
Your commander and I have something in common. I once flew for the Empire too, but Skystrike Academy. Turning to the Rebellion was the smartest move I ever made. I wish more of my friends had done the same. But nope, now they're all dead. Look, I appreciate the talk, but uh, Talus Group's waiting for us. All right. What about you two? Linden. Lindon. The Star Destroyer? Aren't you tossing him in the deep end a little early, Linden? Vanguard oh. can handle it. Can't you? Besides, Project Starhawk needs that Star Destroyer for... Well, you know. It's classified. Wedge made a name for himself at the Battle of Yavin. He knows that system better than the Empire ever will. Me eyes. You'll be fighting on the Rebellion's old turf. So if Wedge has any advice, you'd be smart to listen. You know, a wounded Krakana can still bite. Just watch yourself around that Star Destroyer, huh? Get out there as soon as you can. All right. All right, I guess we're done now that we talked to everyone here. Let's go see what's in the hangar. Talk to Grace. All hands. I can go all the way around. Oh, right. well, let's see what Grace has to say. So, we're headed to Yavin. In exalted company, it seems. And now we know Project Starhawk needs an Imperial Star Destroyer. That's enough firepower to tackle a small fleet. Or a means to catch the Empire off guard. But that wouldn't warrant all this secrecy. There must be more to the commander's plan. We'll just have to trust him. Too bad there isn't an easier way to get what we need. Even a damaged Star Destroyer has deck upon deck of Durasteel plating, turrets, shields. My poor bigoted father called Star Destroyers the fists of the Empire. He wasn't wrong. But they can be beaten. If you're good and lucky. Let's stay optimistic. Well, we're certainly gonna try. Yavin, then. Let's not delay. You got it, lady. All right. Respect. Let's look at it. Mighty. Okay, down there. Come on, get out of the way, Come on. Here we go. Oh. That's great. You can look at it from up there. Oh, wow, that's magnificent. All right. Oh, I can look at it from this side too. Oh, oh, that's good. All right, I think we're about done. Oh, I can still inspect. This is blue rain. Oh, it's like he's actually. Oh, I just saw the visor, didn't I? Or is that just still shady? Huh? I thought it was my visor. Is that I put the visor on already? The helmet. That's my E. All right. The commander wants you on an X-Wing for this mission. Got you outfitted with ion missiles. They disable enemy fighters and they'll disable subsystems on enemy capital ships too. All right, sounds like a plan then. Uh, ion missiles. I'll get it oh. ready. Here we go. What you looking for? What am I looking for? We'll take a flight. always brings back memories. Let's hope for some of that Skywalker luck today. All right, ready, Vanguard? We're heading for the heart of the action. Vanguard, follow his lead. This is Talus Leader, calling for immediate assistance. Captain Antilles with Vanguard Squadron, here to help. It's damn good to see you, Wedge. We've taken heavy losses. We need that Star Destroyer stopped. Don't you worry. We're here to hijack it. You're what? Who was that? Be ready. Interceptors. Those have got to be the first to go. Agreed. They're fast. They'll rip right through our fighters. Vanguard. Prioritize targets. I'm in formation. Oh. That's it. Push the Imperials back. You got it. You're big. What is this? Iron weather 
to deal minimum hull damage, but are ideal for squads. Use them to disable enemy starfighters. Easy target time with is a perfect tool for stripping enemy shields. Okay. I'll take that one out. There, you're clear. You saved my life. Mm -hmm. The Star Destroyer just launched a new swarm of time receptors. Stay sharp. Steals the whole Star Destroyer. It's like saying, alright, let's take their, uh, see that ship they have in the water? It's the biggest one, the aircraft carrier. Let's steal that bad boy. Alright, let's go. Show us the way, Wedge. Oh! Me on plane. Focus your shields before they open fire on us. You can focus your shields towards the front or back of your ship and maximize protection. Balancing shields. Alright, how do you uh, hold square to select front? Oh, okay, that's cool. Knock out its targeting system. Let's do it. Putting power to forward shields. Something happened, but... Oh. Okay. Yeah. Don't 
Targeting system will cycle through objectives. You can change that with the targeting wheel. You can set targeting to flagship systems to focus on subsystems or all enemies. Oh, okay. Hold L2 target wheel. All enemies. Ah, okay. Yes. 
Bad boy now. That star destroyer's taken down its own carrier. What a sight! Yes, the ship is ours. You actually did it. And Project Starhawk has a star destroyer. <laughs> That's mighty. We have a star destroyer on our side. Who would have thought? You can take it from here, Bad Guard. I'll escort Talos Group to safe harbor. Great work. General Sandula will be impressed. Wedge, out. Wow, we finished the mission. Enduring Service Medal. Turn and die. Save first from a deadly tail. Okay, not bad. So. That is the uh, that second mission, chapter two. Not a bad little mission. Right, yeah. Mission two, the skies of Yavin in the books. Make sure you guys leave a like, comment down below how you feel if you liked it. And subscribe as always. I'm trying to get to 100.